In manga, shoujo is one of the subgenres and is perhaps the most popular one in all of manga. It's thought of generally as girls' manga as opposed to shonen, which is boys' action. However, there's a lot of boys or a lot of boys who really like shoujo because it, ha it features intense characters, teenagers going through angst and they're troubled with the relationships and they might have adventures and so it, it's very compelling for everybody. The thing that people like about it and that you will probably recognize if you don't know already is they have the giant glistening eyes that are so attractive and the small noses and mouths and features. The faces are subtle, large, so they're kind of young looking. The bodies are generally simplified, so it's not too tough to draw. I'd say that this is sort of like between easy and medium as far as drawing it. Now, there are very popular characters that you'll know that come from the shoujo genre. There's cat girls, there's school girls, which is just really popular, there are magical girls, and they're also the boyfriends of the schoolgirls. And there are two styles of boyfriends. One is the kind of loyal, heroic, young 14-year-old who never gets the girl. And then there's the kind of older teen idol guy, good-looking, mature, and he always gets a girl, but doesn't really care about her. So here is a schoolgirl type that is a, a shoujo style. She's kind of young and perky. That's, that's kind of looking cute. And here is the bishoujo type, which is actually also a shoujo type genre, and he's the kind of good-looking guy who is unattainable by the girls. So as you can tell just from my describing the characters, there's a lot in there, and, and all of a sudden stories come together. So that's a shoujo genre. Give it a try, you might like it. It's perhaps the most popular style in all of manga.